Reverend Ellen Boone, and I want to welcome you to my show here at Wisdom House. The show is called Translating Nature, and it's work in fiber and watercolor, two very different media, which I think I use to the same end. Paul Clay says that drawing is taking a line for a walk, and pretty soon my lines walked right up off the paper and became pieces of string that walked around and booted themselves and nodded to make three-dimensional objects. I make many um, circles and, and lines, linear elements, which show the vibration of the world, of everything in the world, and how these small vibrations that occur in, between atoms, Brownian motion, atoms bump into each other, and those small vibrations add up and up and up, and that's what makes our big, complicated, changing world go around. And those dramatic moments, they matter. I want to document them and, and try to convey the excitement and drama that I found in seeing them. I was asked if the current pandemic has changed my work at all. And in some ways, no. Um, plein air painting lends itself to social distancing. I'm very lucky I can continue to work as I have worked. There's nothing from st stopping me from going to the studio and going stitch, stitch, stitch. Um, it may be that it's important, I know it is important for some artists to react to our, our current circumstances, but I feel that my job is to is to portray steady pulse of the changes in the landscape through these chaotic times and to, to show that the world goes on. What I want to do with my work is say, say, look, here's the world. Here's a simple object in the world. Isn't it beautiful? And if I can't convey it to you by watercolors, maybe I can convey it through embroidery. And hopefully just to show, to show the beauty and complication of this changing world. I hope you enjoy the show.